Hello my beautiful people, this is Carla with Yo Dramis. Today I have an unboxing about one display that I have wanted for a while and right before Christmas I was like, you know what? My beautiful husband is gifting me this. <laughs> So I drove to the only Barnes & Nobles in my state that had one left and since I had the membership I was able to use my 10% discount to get my Fantastic Beasts one display. So this one can still be found for $159 in uh, the Noble Collection website so I'm going to link it in the description. It comes with the hand painted one display and it has the five wands. So you can see it has Serafina, Picuri Wands, Percival's Graves one. It has Newt, which I have already in my collection, but it was broken because I dropped it. So I'm glad to have a new one. It has, who, who's this? Porpentina, oh, Tina's. I'm not a fan of Tina. Uh, but it has Tina's one, and it has the most beautiful one in the whole Fantastic Beasts series, which is Queenie's. So I have never seen Queenie's one in person, except have I seen it in the Wizarding World? Yes, I think I have. So I wanted to have it as part of my collection. Since I used to have Serafina, but I gifted it to my niece. So I was like, you know what? It's a good investment because I don't have any of these ones in my collection right now. So I'm very excited to add them along with the, you know, beautiful one display that we are about to see. Are you guys ready? No ones are on this slide turn over for wall plague. So if you guys saw my Dumbledore's army one display, they usually come packed this way. Uh, one will have the wall display and the other one will have the ones. Um, again, just as part of our noble collection, really packs their stuff really well. I don't think I've ever received anything from the noble collection that came broken. Um, so I'm very, very pleased with their oh, with their packaging every single time. So let's start with their one display. People ask me all the time on Instagram if these are able to be hanged by the in the wall by command post because I use command post in my office a lot. They are not, they are really heavy. So I use screws for my Dumbledore's army one display and I'll be using screws for this one. As you can see, it only needs one, which is pretty nice because, you know, less. But look at the detail. Um, I think it's made by die cast. I read on the box. It's beautiful. It says Congress of the United States of America. Magical Congress of the United States of America. Beautiful. I really, really like this. It looks very well made. Okay, let's see the ones. <laughs> I'm already thinking, is it worth it, the $159? Um, I think it is. You know, if you can find it secondhand or you can find it um, on sale somewhere, that would be awesome. Um, I Actually, the first time that I sparked my wanting to have it, uh, it's because I saw it. Someone posted it on Facebook Marketplace for like $40. I was like, me, please. So I quickly messaged that person and I think maybe she did some research and she was like, oh, I am deciding to keep it because I see it's worth a lot more. I was like, you know what? No problem. That's fair. Let me know if you change your mind. Um, I don't know if she ever like, sold it or how much. Maybe someone offered more money for it, which, you know, smart. Um, but that was months ago and I have kept thinking about it ever since. So for Christmas, I was like, you know what? We're doing this. Okay, the ones. So let's start with Tina's. Is this Tina's? Yes. I think Tina reminds me a lot of Molly Weasley's wand. Um, and I know this because Molly's is my favorite. Let me get her. Okay, so there, this is Molly's wand and this is Tina's. As you guys can see, they are obviously not the same, but they're very similar. I love Molly's one. It's very simple, but very sturdy. Um, and this is Tina's. Very nice one. I just don't like her character in the movies. It drives me insane. Okay, so this is Percival Graves. Did I read that right? I don't remember. Um, one. Pretty simple. The paint is, I don't know if you guys can see it there. Um, I don't know. It looks, 
it looks like a mystery one. If you guys have seen the normal $40, $50 ones versus the $13 ones from Target and Walmart, which are the mystery ones, their paint is not that professional. I love them because my kids can play with them, but I don't know. If I would have paid $40 for just this one, I would be disappointed. Next, we have Newt's. I love Newt. I love Newt. Newt is like my favorite Hufflepuff. He's like one of my favorite characters in the whole Wizarding World. My oldest son is diagnosed with autism and I just love Newt and how he focuses and believes in something and it's like nothing can move his moral compass. He's just such a beautiful character. I just love him so much. So <laughs> he's one. It's, it's perfection just like he is. Maybe I'm biased because I love him so much. So yes. And I got, I finally got the, the scarf for Fantastic Beast, and I'm very, very excited for April and being able to see the secrets of Dumbledore. Okay, the next one we have is Serafina Pickery's. Um, this one I used to have in my collection, like I said, I got it secondhand um, like two years ago. And uh, it's a very, very cute one. It's funny that it's pink because she's such a strong character. Um, and she's so serious, <laughs> so it's funny to see her have like a pink one, but yeah, pretty cool. Glad to have it again in the collection. And last but not least, I have Queenie's. Oh, okay, I really like Queenie's one, as you guys can see right here. It has like that shell and that, oh, it has like some blue. What is that, like a flower? What is this? You guys can see it there. It's very interesting. It's a very interesting one. And I cannot wait to see what her character does on Secrets of Dumbledore. Um, honestly, she was crazy. <laughs> I, I love Jacob. And I feel Jacob deserves someone that, you know, Jacob should have just married her, okay? If you really love her, marry her, whatever what the government is saying. Yeah, you do you, boo. But at the same time, it's like, Queenie, if you love him, be together. You don't have to sign a paper to, you know, love someone. I don't know. I'm, I'm very, I can see both sides, but I was like, she was already going a little bit cuckoo. So yes, go, go, go be, be with Grindelwald and leave Jacob alone. So I don't know. Let's see what happens with that. She looks very serious on the trailer. So I'm excited to see what is about to go down. Anyway, I'm going to put the display together and show you guys how it looks with all the ones displayed. Okay, so here is a closer and better look to the one display. I really like it, you guys. I feel, again, I wish I'd love to score it secondhand, but I have no regrets about buying it directly from the store. Very, very nice. And now I'll probably be putting it right by the side of the Dumbledore Army's one. Um, still undecided. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. Let me know down in the comments which one was your favorite one. And don't forget to subscribe and like this video if you enjoyed the unboxing. I will see you guys on the next one. Stay safe. Bye-bye.